engineers, respected generals, commanders, commanding officers, and officers commanding. Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning to all of you. Please, my warmest welcome to all the participants of annual commanding officers, officers commanding on college 2022 at the home of Serpa. We will be and delighted to have our chief of army staff as the chief guest amongst us in our annual commanding officers conference 2022. of the 46th raising day are we start. And I'm also very happy today to be here this morning. And I feel really divinely blessed to be here. As a colonel commander, and as the chief of army staff, this is the second time I am sitting here. And I utterly believe that it is a divine blessing from the Almighty Allah. And besides, as I see, so many things happening around, and still we are very healthy, and we have gathered here today, this morning, for a very important session, physically fit. First, my gratitude to Almighty Allah. As I say always, and I strongly believe, and every time, everywhere, I repeat this thing and reiterate, whatever we are today, we would not be, and thus country not be independent. And we must never forget our history and always praise the heroes who has laid their lives for this beautiful today. At this auspicious moment, I pay tribute to our father of the nation, the main architect of our independence, the greatest Bengali leader of all time, Bongo Bandhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, whose dynamic and visionary leadership has given us this independence. At the same note, I'd like to pay homage to our three million martyrs who made supreme sacrifice for our motherland and our tribute to all the freedom fighters, those who are still alive but with a lot of injuries and other things. People have given their comfort for our today. We must not forget. A special tribute to all the fallen members of Bangladesh Army, especially the engineers, who have laid their lives during liberation war and thereafter in different occasions in home and abroad. <coughs> Our deepest condolences for those families. I take this opportunity to pay my gratitude to the Honorable Prime Minister, especially for me, who vested me with this responsibility. At the same time, not only that, she has been always very supportive in modernizing Bangladesh Army. And with her kind support, the governments, all machineries is supporting Bangladesh Army to reach our forces goal and be modernized. So our, on behalf of Bangladesh, I would like to express my gratitude to the Honorable Prime Minister. Thanks to the commander for inviting me, but I don't consider it to be, as the, he said, today's chief guest. The chief is never chief guest. He's always in the part of the family. And being the foreign commander, I don't feel myself to be guest here, to be very candid. Do you think that I am the guest? No. I give a lot of observation. Just now you have seen, I have removed this, you know, yeah. monitor. Yeah. The, the guest will never do that. The guest will accommodate all the problems and by the day for every broken nation of state, of state. I never do that. <coughs> I will do whatever is needed to because you have laid so much beautiful flowers and you have covered it with a monitor. I don't see anything. So what is the benefit? It happens